What's up, Internet? This is Skinny at Coburg Nissan with reaction to the 2019 Nissan Altima release. Just happened today, just a few hours ago, and I am super excited. So the 2019 Altima was launched live. There was a great YouTube broadcast. I'm actually going to link that below, so just check out the comments if you want to go and watch it yourself. But it is going to be fire. It absolutely looks stunning. So they featured the vehicle in this beautiful red paint. But what is amazing about the new Altima, aside from the looks, is the intelligent safety features and the new engines for 2019. So talking about the looks, the new Altima is lower, wider, and longer. Go figure, right? So they're going to make the Altima much more like the Maxima, much more of a four-door sports sedan. And if you ask me, it's about time. That new front grille is amazing. It's the new 2.0 V-Motion grille. So you're going to see that coming around to some more Nissans in the near future. But it looks absolutely incredible. Lower, sleeker, it's exactly what the car needed. Now, as anticipated, it is available in an all-wheel drive configuration. What was unexpected for me is that they're going to offer it on the four-cylinder versions only. I actually thought it was going to be the other way. I thought it was going to be on the V6 only. But it's going to be available on the four-cylinder models, which is going to be absolutely fantastic for Ontario and North America. So I'm really looking forward to that, looking forward to hopping in the driver's seat and seeing how that reacts. Now let's talk about engines. So standard is going to be Nissan's new inline four-cylinder, which is going to give you 188 horsepower, absolutely great fuel economy. It is going to be the choice engine for the vehicle. What I'm really excited to try is Nissan's new variable compression engine, which gives you 248 horsepower and 278 pounds of torque out of a four-cylinder turbocharged engine. And the way they're doing that is changing the compression ratio in the engine for maximum output or fuel economy. It's going to give you kind of the best of both worlds. And that will be really exciting to try. It's a little disappointing you can't get it in all-wheel drive configuration, but I'm sure they have the reasons for it. So when they come in, I will definitely do a comprehensive review on both the four and the uh, variable compression four-cylinder turbo that's coming in. Now some of the advanced safety features, it's going to feature the Pro Pilot Assist. It's going to feature the intelligent cruise control. It's going to feature forward emergency braking, uh, forward collision warning. It is also going to feature the rear collision avoidance. I don't know what the exact term for it is, but basically it won't allow you to back up into things. And the Pro Pilot Assist is going to feature pedestrian warning as well. So it's going to have an absolute handful of advanced safety features, which is great. Um, I love these safety features because unlike in the past with the evolution of ABS braking or stability control and things like that, these features are literally preventing accidents from happening. I'm going to wait for the car wash. Hang on then. Cobra Nissan, get your car washed in Trump videos. Damn it. Stand by. Standing by. Standing by. Oh, look. Aww. It's a nice. Well, the key is clean. Now, what I didn't get to see was the interior shots, but from what I read, it is a great upgrade from the Altima. Again, it's going to have some luxurious features on the inside. It's going to feature uh, a floating screen design in the center display, which is really cool. Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, all those features will be standard. Um, so it looks like the Altima is going to be an absolute hitter for Nissan. It's about time we need a new Altima. It's going to be great. I'm really looking forward to seeing it uh, in, you know, hopefully a few months. I'm not sure when production is scheduled, but uh, it can't come soon enough for us here at Nissan. We're super excited for it. So watch the video below. There's going to be a lot more to come on this vehicle. It is going to be trending for sure. But I just wanted to give you kind of my input and uh, let you know that we are super excited here at Coburg Nissan to see it. So. So guys, thanks so much for watching. There's going to be more to come. As soon as the car arrives, I'm definitely going to do some comprehensive reviews and some walk around. So yeah, just a friendly update on that Altima. We're super excited for it here at Coburg Nissan. Thanks for watching, guys.